to simplify deployment of Team Center. Then the Team Center on the cloud was presented a few years ago. And Siemens worked closely with leading cloud service providers to offer the solutions in a multiple ways. Currently, Team Center is certified and ready for deployment on Amazon Web Services and uh, Microsoft Azure to leverage its global footprint and proven best in class solution. On Amazon Web Services and Microsoft Azure, they have developed cloud formation scripts and uh, automates the deployment of Team Center increases uh, that can be quickly installed and deployed for you. Options with Team Center and the cloud are the Amazon Web Services and Amazon Azure as infrastructure as a service. And then the latest offering is Team Center X, which I'll sort of tell you the differences between um, the third party cloud pro uh, providers versus the Team Center X. Team Center uh, on cloud benefits, of course, uh, simplifies the deployment. They have instant scalability, so you can start small and grow from there. And then uh, the lower cost of ownership. Over time, uh, you not worry about the IT burden and cost and maintenance and IT resources skills to manage that. And then you can see the differences in this chart. Let's start with considering infrastructure as a service cloud model as an entry point to cloud where IAS is a building blocks for cloud IT. Removing the overhead of needing to manage networking, storage, your servers, and associate virtualization. Cloud provides all of these and allows you to quickly scale up and down with demand, pay only for what the resources are used, flexibility and ease of management of resources used in deployment along with the proven cloud service provider. With Team Center X, Siemens will handle all of the infrastructure needs. And again, it will deliver the PLM solution and manage all the backend infrastructure requirements. In the, this chart, you can see the traditional on-prem IT elements with, team, uh, with any PLM implementation has uh, many involved uh, layers that needs to be installed and implemented, which usually the IT staff would have to do and work with uh, either cloud solutions or the internal team to do that. With Team Center X, many of those elements Siemens will handle on the back end, and then the customer would only develop or implement the data packs with them. On Sciatech, we can, what we would do is we would develop, uh, configure, and uh, uh, configure the specific Team Center X based on your requirement in our dev environment, and then we hand that off to Siemens to deploy in production. So that's something that we are doing already for our current customers. With Team Center X, we have a package solution and add ons, uh, which are included and pre configured functionality. And the add-ons with the CAD integration and more, more, more modules that you're familiar with Team Center. And then you can see in this chart, uh, there are different options with Base Pro and Enterprise, depending on size of uh, number of users. And in some cases, there are some uh, elements that you, you can start with lower number of users and then start grow from there. And then depending on how much disk space and data uh, need, and what would be the availability and support model. So those are have a different cost structure. Thanks for checking out our channel. If you like what you saw, make sure to like and subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any new videos. Follow us on LinkedIn, Facebook, and Twitter for the latest engineering news and information. And to see all of our upcoming events, please visit our website at saratech.com events.